Here she comes again. Hmm. Firm. And pungent. Man, that's a big pit. Um, could you remind me how the riddle of Yorn goes one more time? You always take us down when we are in our prime. Devour your sweet rewards, yet I'll return in time. A child of mine will rise out of his rotten bed, up from a hidden pit long after I am dead. Whoa. Yeah. Bring us a solution, and you may enter the pyramid. Bye! <laughs> Sense you later. Why would I gunk up my cool stool with sap? These two pieces do not work well together. The stool looks better without it. Making it sticky won't make it better art. Hey, you take sap down from a tree, right? And? And? Well, that's it. This stool is the solution to your riddle. How's that? Well, I mean, you could sit on it while you think of the real answer. I have a piece of art here that is the solution to your riddle. Does it have a pit? Or children? Not really. Okay, I retract my statement. you get back to your screaming. Yeah, please leave before I vomit, you foul, rootless stump.
It's tree barf, not fruit dip. You can still see the grain of the wood. Wow, it's getting thicker every second. Strong stuff, kid. Don't mess with it. Wow, it's getting thicker every second. Strong stuff, kid. Don't mess with it. I don't want to get it stuck. I may not like this art piece, but I don't want to ruin it. Ick. No. I don't want to get it stuck. Why ruin this pretty crystal sun? seagull trap, but really, I don't need a seagull trap yet, or ever. I probably will never need one of those to tell the truth. I really thought that one was different. <sighs> Let's try it again, Clarence. That's the ticket. Steady. 
What's up, maidens? Uh, just waiting around to save the town. Same as always. See you maidens later. Ciao! Here she comes again. Check it out, fruit. No thanks. These are our only robes. We don't want to get them all sticky. It's the answer to your riddle. But it's just a fruit. With a pit inside. Oh my god! It's so simple! Why didn't we get that? Oh man! That's been bugging us all day! But what does it have to do with the pyramid? Huh? Oh, nothing. It's just something our friend Becky Yorn told us this morning. <laughs> she thinks she's so smart. I can't wait to rub this thing in her face. So, uh, can I go in there now? Oh, yeah, yeah, whatever. Knock yourself out. I'm going in. Okay. Such strange shapes in here. I don't think that's the right shape to go in there. I don't think that's the right shape to go in there. It's that same religious symbol, but this one is recessed, like a socket. I found my circuit control router. That's awesome. Now I can fire up the ship and get back to Laruna. You're welcome. Oh, yeah. Uh, thanks for finding my circuit control router. I lost it during the crash and couldn't find it anywhere. I drew pictures of it for the locals and kept saying, Give me this. Give me this. After a few years, I just had to put myself in cryogenic storage and hope someone smarter would come along and find it. Are you the dead eye god? Man, that's so embarrassing. The locals called me that when my spaceship crashed here, and I kind of went along with it because, well, you know, god. Were you really dead? Nah, I was just preserved in cryogenic suspension for 300 years? Huh. I guess all the locals I knew here are long dead. Uh, that's kind of a relief. They were a little annoying. Part of the reason I went into chrysolation, to tell you the truth. Can I help? Depends. You know anything about spaceships? No. I'm just a baker from sugar bunting. Sugar bunting? Is that anything like steel bunting? When I first landed, there was this town called Steel Bunting that the locals were all afraid of. Apparently, it's full of badasses. So we're standing in a spaceship? Just the upper observation deck. The rest of it's buried underneath. 
I'm gonna need to fix more wiring before I can even gain access to it. What's all this equipment do? This is the main observation deck of my ship. So this stuff mostly scans for signs of life or habitable worlds. Anything that would help the mission. What was your mission? Operation Dandelion. Laruna was dying. The spaceship was supposed to give us a fresh chance in a new home. But instead, we crashed here. What's Laruna? That's my home planet. Or at least it was. Who knows if it's even still there. How'd your ship crash? I hate to think about it, but there's a chance it was me. I tried to hack into the ship's controls and take over. Then some weird stuff happened, and the next thing I know, I'm here. Does the ship you mentioned have any weapons? Hey, whoa. There's a giant monster that is destroying villages and eating young girls, and it may or may not have already... My whole family might be... Anyway, I just need to take down a horrible monster. Will you help? I... I mean, sure. I, I owe you one. But my ship didn't have any weapons that I know of. I'll dig around once I get this heap working and let you know. Okay, see you later. Uh-huh. Hey, put that laser coil back. That's how I generate light for my search beam. I'm just cleaning it. It fits. Careful with that device. If it's hooked up wrong, it can be very destructive. Ooh, pretty colors. Whoops. Hey, that was my amplifying quartz. Without that, how am I supposed to read the data from the search beam? Sorry. I'll get a new one. Uh, don't bother. All I really care about is getting out of here, and I don't need a search beam for that. Hi. Hey. Any luck so far? Well, there are some missing parts, but if I can get them all, I should be able to get something working. As a weapon? Oh, uh, no, sorry. Get my ship working so I can get out of here, I mean. I haven't started on the whole weapon thing yet. Let me know if you have any ideas. Okay, see you later. Uh-huh. The top of this pyramid is transparent. So strange. The bottom socket is empty. Uh, yes. You broke my amplifying cords, remember? I'm going to replace it, I swear. Nailed it! Hey, dead eyes awake? Haha, <laughs> right! When the dead eye god rises, we'll know. We are his most devoted followers. Plus, there will be, like, fireworks and reporters, probably. Definitely. What is that strange symbol I see all over the pyramid? You mean the Gamethus? That was the sacred symbol of the Dead Eye God. 
It is said that in his day, the Deadeye God would draw the Ganethus for all his followers. That was very important to him, and so we worship it to this day. Bye. <laughs> Sense you later. Maidens? Uh, just waiting around to save the town. Same as always. See you maidens later. Ciao! Okay, let's try it there. Marshal Dune? Mm hmm? How about now? Is the construction coming along better? Ah, the sand is falling apart, and so am I. Better let you get back to the feast. Yes, yes. These maidens aren't going to serve up themselves. Here, this will make your sand mixture stick together better. Really? How do you know? I'm a baker. I know my ingredients. At this point, I'd try anything. Hey, Clarence, bring that load down here, will you? I hope you're right about this. It's never failed me before. How many times have you used it? Never. Shh, let's watch. Here comes a wave. I can't look. What'd I tell you? Now that's a sandcastle. Looks like we're in business. I guess it's showtime. Wait, I'm not ready yet. What? Well, I owe you one, so I can stall for a little while, but hurry back. I can't keep the beast from coming. Be right back. I have to get some sort of powerful weapon before Mog Chothra gets here. Wow, it's getting thicker every second. Strong stuff, kid. Don't mess with it. This laser doesn't seem to work without that magnifying quartz, or something like it. you get back to your screaming. Yeah, please leave before I vomit, you foul, rootless stump. You can still see the grain of the wood. <laughs> that would gunk it all up. ruin 
filling them with sap? you done? Uh, fixed your ship? You put the amplifying quartz after the laser coil. If I powered up the beam in this configuration, I mean, the thermal feedback alone could melt down my entire ship. I could conceivably release the extra energy out of the targeting iris, but that would only produce a powerful, weaponized... Well, heck, let's just call a death ray a death ray. Yay! And I told Becky, you're so ugly, <laughs> I'm glad I'm blind. <laughs> okay, the targeting iris has 300 years of rust on it, but it should do the trick. I'll try to lure him into a good spot. You can fire the weapon with this remote trigger. Like this? Okay, shut it down. Clarence, was that you? Knock it off! Just use quick bursts or that hacked circuit of yours will cause a meltdown up here. I'm not sure how to thank you for this. You know what? The whole time I was on that spaceship, all I really wanted was to be as useful as I feel right now. Well, wish me luck. Hey, if you're really from steel bunting, I'm sure you're not gonna need it. This is how I fire the Deadeye Pyramid Beam, when the time is right. Ready when you are, Marshal. Ladies and gentlemen, it's showtime! You know what to do, girls. with one arm tied behind my back, but not two. Now I need to find a more 
vulnerable spot. Need to wait. Fire away! Just a slap on the wrist. Take the shot! Come on, you stupid death ray! Do it! Hit it, dead eye god! Nailed it! Take the shot! I'm getting through that thick hide. Do it! No good. Even his eyes are armor plated. Hit it, Dead Eye God. No good. His mouth is closed. Hit it. Your number, Mom Chathra. I could beat you with one arm tied behind my back, but not two. Hit it, Dead Eye God. 
god. I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. Hit it. There's more where that came from. I could beat you with one arm tied behind my back, but not two. I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. Hurry up and recharge already. Dang, the hide's too thick. Do it! Gotcha. Fire away. Oh yeah. Getting through that thick hide. That's not going to work. Hit it. Fire away. Gotcha. Do it. Yeah. You recognize me, don't you? One tasty maiden over here. When I cut you open, I'd better not find my family inside.
getting through that thick hide. Take the shot! I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. my shots. shove it in his ugly mouth, but I can't... Kick you again? Follow me, Mog. You're going down, you stupid Mog. thing.
over here, you take the shot. Nothing can get through that skin. No, I need to find a more vulnerable spot. Hit it, Dead Eye God. I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. Over here, you nasty old dumpling. Do it! I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. Fire away! Dang! The hide's too thick! The skin deflects my shots. Nothing can get through that skin. Even his eyes are armor-plated. I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. Hit it, Deadeye God! Even his eyes are armor-plated. He must have a more vulnerable spot. Now! Now I need to find a more vulnerable spot. Drag your saggy old tentacle- Hit it! I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. Armor-plated. Do it! I don't think I'm getting through that thick hide. Even his eyes are armor-plated. He must have a more vulnerable spot.